after file uploading now understand the web.xml file first a request comes to the dispatcher servlet our dispatcher servlet is located in vbinf folder and after that look at our dispatcher servlet file our base package is commerce.spring.upload this is our base package and for file upload you need to add this pin file sorry this pin class of name commons multipart resolver and this is our file size in kb which is 50 mb and for file uploading also make sure in your apache web apps manager web in a folder under dot xml this xml code should have written there otherwise it will throw file exceeds limit error so i think all have done now so I'm now running it. Let's check it. Is it working correctly or not? Oops, I forgot to delete, to delete this in the JSP page. So now run this once again. It is running correctly. This is our index.jsp page code. I have added one input type file for file uploading and one text box folder descriptions. And the action is upload file. First, check it is it working correctly or not. I will upload one text file. description is text file so upload it oh it is working correctly fine and at the console it is printing the location of the file which is created so copy this location go to our file explorer and print this and hit enter button and look at this path and file is present so it is correctly working now understand the code for home page this code is there this is our the js page name and this is our attribute name message and this is our attribute message and here we are getting our message from the controller page and after and after pressing the button the action is the upload file of method post here we are getting the upload file action 
and we are getting the description of name description text box using request param and file of our file and we are using multi part file for handling this file and check if the file if file is not empty then create your own folder of I have created resources folder resources folder to my absolute path to get your absolute path of your project you need to write this code request or get solid context or get real path and pass this relate to a path to as a parameter and now convert your file into bytes byte array and create your direct file directory if file doesn't exist it will create automatically using this code and to get your absolute path in your location with file name this code is written there and for buffer output string this writes into the web byte array and close the output string and I am using I have used the model to add the attribute and to show the message on the success page and the attribute name is upload message and this is our success message so I am getting this support message on this page here so once again run this user image file about successfully file name dt.jpg description user so all are working fine let's check it on location yes look at this you can directly visit this location from here also go to your work location minus clip project go to metadata plugins scroll it down go to org.eclipse.wst-server.core temp0 w2b webs project name minus spring mvc file upload resources folder so that's it from this tutorial hope you guys like this video and make sure to subscribe my channel thank you for watching have a nice day